Google's banning another misbehaving certificate authority from Chrome. Guys, you know what that means, right? That means this certificate authority have signed many, many thousands of certificates and possibly other certificate authorities. And those certificate authorities might have signed certificates or other certificate authorities. Anything under that. If your website is under this particular certificate authority, it's dead. It's going to be blocked in Chrome 90. So let's find out why. What did, what did this naughty certificate authority do? Let's read. Google intend to ban and remove support from Chrome for digital certificate issued by Spanish certificate authority Camer Ferme. Camer Ferme? Camer Ferme. Camer Ferme. All right. Apparently, it's a certificate authority. The browser maker announced this week. The ban will come into effect with the launch of Chrome 90. Scheduled for release mid April 2021. So you still have time. So if your if your website is signed by this certificate authority, time for time for an alternative. To be honest, I don't know why you wouldn't sign. Uh, I mean, why would you create a certificate other than Let's Encrypt or those free one? And there is no reason to pay for certificate authorities anymore. Like yeah, to spin them up three months later, just spin up another one. And then uh, a lot of web servers just uh, allow you to automate that thing very easily. I don't know. Let me know, guys, if you prefer free uh, certificate authorities or just uh, you have to, you'd rather pay for a yearly one. I'd like to know the difference. After Chrome 90 launch, all websites that use TLS certificates issued by Camera Verima to secure their HTTPS traffic will show an error and will not load in Chrome forward i'm guessing this is uh they, they're gonna uh return and um so your certificate might be valid guys right but the psychelic check to check the parent right certificate when check the parent up up all, all the way that will fail because the certificate authority is not valid right that's the problem here the the chain this is called the certificate chain which i talked about many times right here is here Check it out if you want to learn about certificates and certificate authorities, all that jazz. So the chain will be broken. If your certificate is signed by multiple certificate authority, you'll be fine. I think you can be in that configuration. A little bit complex, though. The decision to ban Camera Verma certificates was announced on Monday after a company was given more than six weeks to explain a string of 26 incidents. What the guy? What the heck are you guys doing? They gave you, give you some leeways, and you didn't fix your stuff. The answer is detailed by Mozilla. Let's go read the stuff. I actually opened it up. What's going up? What's going on? The page list confirms suspicious issues involving account for What did you guys do? Issue B. What is issue A? Okay, I guess we're starting from issue B. Issue D. Duplicate subject alternative. Issue F. Issue H. Why is it? That's weird. Why is it? Why are issues labeled alphabetically instead of numbers? Issue J. Invalid DNS names. Ooh. Issue L. Issue N. Issue P. Issue R. Issue T. Multi cert. Look at that. You guys screwed up. Issue V. Issue X. Issue Z. We run out of alphabets. <laughs> issue BB. You know you screwed up if Mozilla ran out out of alphabets. Right, and they have to start over. Issue BB, issue DD, issue FF. I don't even know what those are, to be honest. I'm not an expert in security. There's a guy, what's his name? Uh, Ryan Sleevy, I believe, on Twitter. Check him out. He's the, he's the certificate, all this security stuff, uh, certificate authorities, all that stuff. I follow him for my phone and understand this stuff. But like that, that I understand. Online certificates uh, status protocol. Yeah, looks like there's a lot of a lot of stuff that this certificate authority did wrong. Apparently, starting a certificate authority is not, not easy, huh? You gotta follow all this stuff. And and these are not just standards, guys. This is this is to ensure security reasons, right? The the trust and how do you assign certificate and how do you do uh, how do you continue to um 
validate your child certificate and child certificate authorities and making sure all is good, right? This is, this is stuff, stuff. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be banned. Access the years browsers makers have uh, often banded together to kick out certificate authorities that don't follow these rules. Other certificate authorities that have been banned from Chrome in the past include Semantic. Isn't that the Norton stuff? Digitotor, I remember this one. This one screwed up so bad, Digitotor, and I'm going to make a video about them. Digitotor, they, I think, I don't remember, I think either their private key got leaked so that all of a sudden someone started generating certificates on behalf of Digitotor for google.com and for gmail and someone i think from iran uh try to log in and they found that they're getting these errors sometimes like they're getting this error sometimes you you're not because G DigiNotor was at some point i think it's dutch was a good certificate authority so the browser would do a the psychedelic chain the chain go up to the chain and say hey this is a good certificate Right? and when you get to that that's nasty so that that was a uh, that was bad that was really bad so i don't know what what uh, i don't think uh what camouflage whatever this <laughs> this certificate is called they didn't do that bad it just didn't follow the rules it seemed like it right if your private key is leaked you're screwed that's it right because if you get a, if i get your private key if your certificate authority a private key i can use it to generate certificates right on on your behalf and then since certificate authority is, is trusted everywhere anyone will be trusted that's why all this uh, ocsp protocol is important to check if the check if the certificate is not uh, revoked like the certificate revocation list it's, it's a beast right all this stuff keeping track of all this stuff is so beast Nevertheless, just the ba google ban alone is more than enough to cripple <laughs> camera firma business with a market share of around 60%. Wow, that is big. 60 to 70% is a de facto death blow. Wow, okay. Oh, wait a second. That's just, that's the Chrome market share. I thought I thought that Calmer Pharma is like a 60% market share. I was like, no, that ain't right. Carbis Facebook has not returned a request for comments. So nobody commented on this stuff. But yeah, guys. Yeah. The, the internet is more secure once again. We're moving towards at least every day to a better secure internet. Okay. All right, guys. Very quick news. Well, I'm going to make a very quick news today. I'm going to see you in the next one. You guys stay awesome. Go buy your.